Hello and welcome to the beginning of a new reaction series. Today I am going to start watching Avatar The Last Airbender. This series has always been on my list but I just have never really gotten around to watching it. But with the live action coming out shortly I thought it'd be best to start watching this now. So my plan is to watch all of season one and have all of those reactions posted before the live action series releases. And then I plan on reacting to all of those live action episodes as well. And once I've finished reacting to those live action episodes I will continue watching the animated series and post seasons two and three on here also. So that's the plan I have at the moment for Avatar The Last Airbender. I'm actually really excited to start watching this today because it's been around for a while. It's very popular, I've only heard good things about it, and now I guess it's just time for me to experience it myself. So a little rundown on what I do know about the series. I know it follows the character named Aang, I think, and we're in this world where people utilize different elements. So earth, fire, water, air, all those ones. But that is like all I know about this series. Nothing else. So I'm going into this fresh knowing pretty much nothing. I'm excited to see what happens. And I'm keen to see just why this series is so popular as well. If so many viewers love this series, then I don't doubt I will too. Now, if you are after uncut reactions or early access to these episodes, you can check out my Patreon, which is linked in the description. Otherwise, if you enjoy this content, please be sure to like, comment your thoughts below. I love hearing all of your thoughts. I just love reading your comments and seeing what you guys have to say. Also, please don't forget to subscribe and let's get into the very first episode of Avatar The Last Airbender. Time of peace. Okay, a little bit of when history. Avatar kept balance between the water tribes, Earth Kingdom, Fire Nation, and Air Nomads. So are they all like four separate tribes? Only the Avatar mastered all four elements. Ah, uh, okay. But when the world needed him most, he vanished. That's not good. So what, well, the Fire Nation has just destroyed everything? Some people believe that the Avatar was never reborn into the Air Nomads and that the cycle is broken. But I haven't lost hope. Avatar will return to save the world. Yeah, he will. Okay, so they're all like, they're four separate tribes and the Fire Nation has gone up against all of them. The others are kind of banding together to try and defeat the Fire Nation. And I'm assuming this was the border. The water tribe. Not getting away from me this time. Watch and learn, Katara. This is how you catch a fish. Oh. Uh. Sokka, look! <laughs> That's so cool. So can everyone in that nation control water? Hey! <gasps> Why is it that every time you play with <laughs> magic water, I get soaked? It's water bending. And water yeah, bending. Yeah, ancient art unique to our culture blah 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 ah. okay so not everyone has that ability can she do anything with her power can she like stop them from <laughs> crashing into icebergs you don't like my steering well maybe you should have water bended us yeah exactly <laughs> i'm embarrassed to be related to you did she just cause that from now on you're on your own Oh no. So are there others in the water tribe who have the a bit powers as well? Or is it just her? Is that an iceberg? Just popped out from the bottom of the ocean. Oh. It's a special iceberg. <laughs> that is Freaky. I'd be running away, honestly. I'd be I'd be running in the opposite direction. Oh it looks like it's gonna take a while. Or not. <laughs> he actually looks kinda of terrifying. Oh Okay, not anymore. I need to ask you something. What? Please come closer. What is it? Will you go penguin sledding with me? <laughs> what? I was not expecting that. Wake up, buddy. What is that? He's got a pet. That's cute. Oh wow. That's that's a what big pet. Is that thing? He was probably trying to signal the fire navy. Oh yeah, I'm sure he's a spy for the fire navy. You can <laughs> tell by that evil look in his eye. <laughs> Oh, that's so cool. An air vendor would be like so cool. Oh, <laughs> I thought he was gonna fly. <laughs> Why 
Why are you smiling at me like that? Uh, oh, I was smiling? <laughs> he's so confused. <laughs> he doesn't even know what he's doing. Oh, the Fire Nation. They're on their way there. I feel bad for their village. Is something bad gonna happen to them? Because they're like right beside the light. And the Avatar is alive. You won't find him. Your father, grandfather, and great-grandfather all tried and failed. Damn. Oh yeah, because it's been a hundred years, right? If you had any idea what happened to the Avatar... Uh, no. I didn't know him. Well, you see, I'm the Avatar. So that's how they ended up like that. This is the entire village. Entire village? Oh. Bang. Oh no. Well, no one has seen an airbender in a hundred years. Oh. We thought they were extinct. Oh, what? Wait, airbenders are meant to be extinct. It's not for stabbing. It's for airbenders. Oh, that's so cool. You can just like summon things with the air. It lets me control the air currents around my glider and fly. You know, last time I checked, Humans can't fly. He's an airbender, man. He can control air. <laughs> that is so cool. That, not so much. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's kind of funny. You're a waterbender. Well, sort of. Not yet. So she's probably the only one in the village, right? I sense he's filled with much wisdom. Yeah, definitely. You can you can tell. You can really tell. Surely all of the Fire Nation has like severe burns on their body, right? Like if they battle each other and the fire hits them. No, nah, there's gotta be something that prevents it from hitting them, right? Be over a hundred years old. That guy's got a burn mark around his eye. The four elements. I'll need more than basic fire bending to Wait, is, so is Aang the same avatar from a hundred years ago? But he hasn't had a hundred years to master his power because he's been frozen for a hundred years. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Stop it. Stop it. He's not happy with the distraction he's causing. You don't have time for fun and games with the war going on? What war? You're kidding, right? Penguin! <laughs> Wait. They've got two flippers, two pairs of flippers, and whiskers. They're like a weird mix between penguins and seals. Isn't there someone in your tribe who can teach you? No. Mm. You're looking at the only waterbender in the whole South Pole. What about the North Pole? There's another water tribe up there, right? Oh, that's maybe they have waterbender halfway across the world. <laughs> it's not exactly turn right at the second glacier. Yeah, exactly. It's on the other side of the world, <laughs> but you forget, I have a flying bison. Appa and I can personally fly you to the North Pole. Yeah, that'll only take a few hours, right? But in the meantime, can you teach me to catch one of these penguins? <laughs> that easy. Oh. <laughs> That's cute. Oh, well. That seems so fun. I feel bad for the penguins, though. <laughs> oh. Oh, that was fun. Are the penguins okay after that? <laughs> a fire navy ship. That's not the one that the prince was on, right? The ship could be booby trapped. If you want to be a bender, you have to let go of fear. She gave him pretty quickly. <laughs> How long were you in that iceberg? Yeah. I don't know. A few days, maybe. A few days. Like a hundred years. Yeah. What? That's impossible. Do I look like a 112 year old man to you? He's 12. What's that you said about Oh no. Traps? Oh no, oh no. <laughs> this is 100 years old, this shit. Uh oh. Get out of there. Oh no, is that the Fire Nation watching? Found the Avatar as well as his hiding place. No. So that was the very first episode of Avatar The Last Airbender and I loved it. 
I feel like it's definitely going to be a bit of a fun, lighthearted series, which makes sense because I'm pretty sure when this was made, it was directed at kids. It's nothing like any of the other series or anime that I've been watching recently. Definitely does not seem to be going down that dark path. <laughs> the whole history and the world building, it's very easy to understand at this stage. So from what I understand, you have the Water Tribe, the Earth Kingdom, the Fire Nation, and the Air Nomads. And each of those make up one of the four elements. And then the Avatar is the one who has mastered all four elements. And that is who the Fire Nation is currently after. So the Avatar kind of brought balance to the world, but then when he disappeared a hundred years ago, the Fire Nation then attacked and that's when the war began. Is that right? Am I understanding this so far? So it seems like Aang is the exact same Avatar guy from a hundred years ago. At first I thought maybe the last Avatar guy kind of just went off into hiding, died, and then Aang kind of was reincarnated as the next Avatar, but it does not seem to be the case. Aang is still physically 12 years old, but he has lived for about 112. I'm also loving the characters so far. So like Aang, Katara, and Sokka, they all seem very likable. Aang is so cute. He's like a 12 year old boy. He just wants to go penguin sledding and have fun. Katara, I feel like might be no more than a couple years older than Aang. She seems very lively as well. I'm loving her. She's probably my favorite at the moment. And she's also the only waterbender at the moment. Well, in her village, at least. I love how Aang's first reaction to that news as well was hey let's just head to the north pole real quick and go find someone who can help you like we can take you there let's go right now if you want <laughs> that's so sweet i wasn't expecting for them to live with like a big tribe but at the same time like there was not even 20 people in that tribe i was expecting more than that but i guess all the men had kind of gone off to the war right also with Aang, i love the airbending ability i feel like that has got to be maybe the coolest one i'll have to wait till i see like all of the powers in action but the airbending Bending, like you can fly, you could control just anything around you because everything around you is air. Surely you could like kind of teleport as well. See, so many endless possibilities when it comes to air. And then we caught a glimpse of the Fire Nation, right? And Prince Zuko is still after the Avatar. He's finally found him. And now I'm kind of nervous as to what is going to happen in the next episode. If the Fire Nation is as ruthless as what we've been hearing about, I feel feel like there is a chance that he could just completely burn down the village, maybe kill them all. Not Katara and Soka, but everyone else. But at the same time, I'm thinking like, it's a kid's show, like they wouldn't do that. I really hope not. But yeah, I am nervous to see what happens there. But yeah, like I said, that was just a really nice episode. Great introduction to the whole world characters, all of that. I'm loving it so far. I'm really keen to watch more. And now I'm excited to watch the live action. I'm only one episode into the animated series and I'm already feeling that way about the live action. I'm so keen for it. Please don't forget to like, comment your thoughts on this video, subscribe if you haven't already. Anything you can do to help out my channel means so much, so thank you for that. Also remember, I do have my Patreon linked in the description for early access and uncut reactions. So please check that out if you're keen. Otherwise, stick around for future videos.